Hello, and this is episode 101 of Easy Education, covering molecular bond angles and VSEPR theory. VSEPR, or VSEPR theory, provides an explanation of bond angles and, to a certain degree, polarity of molecules. Vesper theory relies on the idea that the electron pairs repel each other and will try to be as far apart from each other while still remaining tethered to the central atom. Let's look at an atom with three other atoms bonded to it. Vesper theory states that these will repel each other, so consequently the angles between these atoms will be equal. In this case, it's 120 degrees. This repulsion theory can also be demonstrated at home with about six to eight inflated latex balloons. Okay, now if this is your balloon, the nucleus of the atom is deep in the center of this balloon. The outer edge represents the electron field around the nucleus. Okay, now that that's clear, let's continue. Now suppose you have two balloons, and you try to squish them together. The outer edge prevents this from happening. The same is true for atoms. The electron shells repel each other and keep the atoms from squishing together. Now let's go back to our first atom. The red circles are a rough depiction of an electron orbital, and are like the edges of the balloons. They keep the atoms from getting close to each other. This is what happens if all the valence electrons of a central atom are available for bonding. But if they are not, the unpaired electron set acts much the same way as the electrons of the bonded atom. Here is an atom diagrammed in Lewis format, with red circles to illustrate the repulsion field. As you can see, even the unpaired electrons have a repulsion field. And if you're not tired of the balloon analogy yet, you can demonstrate using a smaller balloon, as it will still hold its place and push the other balloons out of the way. The balloons are great for creating the shapes in three dimensions, something I cannot do on this video. So that brings us to the end with a brief explanation of VSEPR theory. Next episode is over dimensional analysis.